Hello, everyone. Uh, first of all, I would like to introduce myself. Myself is Chirag Jogi. Uh, today's topic is more about uh, AI-powered app analytic-driven PDF interactive that we have done. So this is more about interactive PDF document management system, how AI we have leveraged on top of Voodoo to make people's life easy. And uh, this is more insights about how our tool is going to work and how you can leverage AI on top of document management. Quickly brief about our company. So we are a digital solution provider, Brainwire Infotech, and uh, around 1,800 team that we have. We are in the market from last 22 years. Uh, we are gold partner in US, and we are presence in multiple other countries. In Europe, we are into UK, Greece, Netherlands. Uh, we have office in Canada, Singapore, Middle East, multiple uh, location in India as well. Lots of credentials acquisition that we have, uh, got. So recently we got the UDU Outstanding Customer Satisfaction Award. And we are number one on clutch. Around like 200 people has given testimonials ratings on our website. If you talk about UDU profile, uh, we are having a strong team of 350 developers, consultant, who works on uh, UDU execution. Around that 180 is a certified UDU consultant. We did around 250 plus projects and multiple integrations with the different different third party and other uh, integrator. To talk about myself, I am into this uh, industry or experience wise, 13 years of experience in UDU specific, ha handling a team of 250 resource and very strong into uh, retail manufacturing distribution, consultation, gap analysis, solution architect kind of thing. Today's we are going to talk about more about AI driven document analytic essentials, how you can leverage that, the key features of that solution, and what are the expected results that you can get. Yeah, so just to give in a brief, uh, this is Stanford approved project uh, that we have uh, delivered. And uh, in that, th this kind of tool, we have created a AI driven document management solutions on top of Voodoo, where right now all the PDFs are kind of boring, right? So people, when start reading the PDF, it's very hard to understand all the context. Also, what approach we did, like, out of 50 pages, might be five or 10 pages will be very much useful or the content should be interactive. So what we did, that data we have given into AI algorithm. Uh, we have done data processing and capturing all the data, what are the important knots that we have captured in a separate way. Multiple times, the frequent uh, questions that we are getting on that PDF, we have collected all this data, and we have processed that FAQs. So when people or person reading that PDF can focus on that specific area, that specific uh, FAQ, and they can get the more insights of that PDF. The more use case I will talk about Let's, let me first talk about the use cases of uh, this whole uh, tool. So this PDF driven tool can be used in multiple industries. So if think about the imagine like a coaching institute. Lots of students are having lots of PDFs or courses to read. How we can make their life easy. So uh, we have given an, a PDF such a way. In same PDF while student is reading, they, we have enabled a video over there. So on specific courses or specific content, if they have any doubts or any questions, then, then they can play a video of related information inside PDF itself. Second scenario, where they are stuck in somewhere, we have given a teacher's audio inside PDF itself. So if they feel like I'm interacting with someone, I'm not standalone reading the PDF, they can run a video or audio, and they can get insights of what teacher is trying to convey regarding that courses. So that video, audio, interaction that we have done on PDF. Other than, th other than that, we have done chat platform in PDF itself. What, what I mean is like, when I'm reading a PDF, I can collaborate with my other student as well. So I can chat. I have a doubt in this specific section. Can you help me out? Then they can collaborate inside PDF. They can share the information, PDF, uh, attachments, images, whatever they want. So such kind of interactive thing that we have did. 
There are other cases as like, like for example, procurement, tender management, blanket agreement, long tender process is there. How can I make it interactive? So that we did. E-commerce, e-book, catalog. In catalog, you are searching for the products, variant, its attributes, all this thing. If customers who is willing to purchase that product have five questions, so they can run a video over there, they can ask some questions on a real time inside Udo itself, and they can get in a more clarity. The use case that Fabian yesterday explained was in Udo 17, they created a PDF which is way more attractive and uh, having lots of information apart from just simple quotation. On top of that, we did in what we, our plan and in 16 also we tried to did that as well. If you send someone that quotation, they will, they will have five more questions as well to sign a contract with you. It will be not easy, like you send a problem, they will do the payment. They want to talk with someone, they want to ask you questions, what are the terms and conditions, what are the payment plans, what are the benefits or AMC that I'm going to get. So to, to reduce that back and forth, to, to make it kind of uh, quick in terms of decision making, when you send this, using this tool, the PDF to the customer, they will get their answer in the PDF itself. So we will make sure the whatever the data accumulation that we did on the process generation AI that we have done on that PDF, all the answers, all the format, they will get from the invoice format itself. So they don't need to even ask certain questions. In automobile industry, Rendell, you have seen like uh, as a user manual, person has to see how the spare part need to be repaired, what are the diagrams, what tools that I need to use. So this, using this PDF user manual format, it is not just a standard static word. It's more interactive. And uh, the images can link with the certain parameters where they can see actually what that uh, actual information are. So such kind of things that we did in different, different industry. I will play a short video for you so you get an uh, insights what I'm really talking about. So this is the Sony uh, Bravia uh, reference book, that reference that we take. Uh, so this is a whole PDF you upload into the system, right? Uh, the keyword search, it's already there in standard PDF. Uh, on top of that, what we did, each and every users will have their own login. They have uh, access right management on top of it, what, what access they can leverage of that PDF. Here you can see the FAQs. In the PDF itself, we are given a multiple FAQs questions where people can ask questions, whoever this access PDF has been shared, they can collaborate. So they can ask certain question. It's a group of institute or group of uh, company uh, have reading this process and they can ask the certain questions. Uh, they can find and related materials, the images, the videos, and the AI we have used is like, while you are actually, uh, playing that video, system will highlight that related contents. So it that much relatable. Like what I'm looking at and what I'm reading, it's actually what they are referring to. So that makes very interactive to the person who is understanding the whole process. So uh, this is more about uh, uh, collaborations, attachments, and uh, you can download and share as well. So while you download, it does have all the highlights, videos, chat, attachments, everything in build. This is the audio that I was talking about. So in PDF itself, at a certain point, I have uploaded my audio. So if I have a question on certain things, I can play that audio which the instructor had uploaded, and from the audio, I can get the information. So uh, this is more about the creator and viewer kind of tool where uh, the usage can be in multiple way and the more focused we have done into document management, PDF engagement, where uh, somebody has created the PDF and the, who is viewing the PDF, how both collaborations can be done. So catalog, efficient feedback, if you're doing survey as well, you can get that. Uh, Real-time collaboration, live discussion, instance ch chat, This is more about uh, how empower document real-time 
excellence that you get. So we have done also that kind of thing. Each keyword that we have uh, linked with the kind of chat GPT, you don't need to again what Odoo 17 has already right now has provided. On top of that, we did a more advanced thing where each keyword, you, if you have any kind of alternative, if you want to find any synonyms, if you want to find anonyms, so you don't need to again go to the different, different tool. From PDF itself, you click over there and you find five different synonyms of that. So such kind of uh, AI-driven approach that we have given. This is the key solutions that we have uh, achieved uh, in terms of walking through the step-by-step -step process as a uh, engagement and uh, guidelines. Data tracking, data track of valuable analytics like views, time, how much time that person has visited that PDF. What are the duration of that uh, engagement? What are the reports that have generated from that PDF? So all these things as a BI kind of analytic tool also, we have enabled on top of this tool. Document Q&A session, customizable icon manuals that we have done. SEO perspective, it's very much useful where uh, if you want to uh, print out an e-brochure, where for giving a better visibility to your customer. So when you are sending only a standard email rather than you send this interactive PDF, right? So it will have more interactive and more chances of sales conversion. So these are the few uh, screenshot which is of our product uh, that you can look into it. So it's a real uh, case studies uh, where people are uh, using the things. This is live chat collaboration thing. This is the audio which you can enable from the related content while walking through the pro project proposal. These are the graphics and uh, AI driven analytics tools and dashboard that we have uh, created on top of Voodoo. The audio, uh, there are multiple uh, stakeholders can upload their audios and then they can, as a clip, they can run on a system. Heat map, webs, map uh, reporting that we have given for government entities. Location analytics and overview that you can generate from the uh, document format. Few are the expected results that we have seen wherever we have implemented. It's more about uh, 120 percentage increase in the engagement happen while interacting with the different different stakeholders. 15 percent boost in the customer conversion that we have received after com replacing with the standard PDF with the, this AI driven document format. Real-time customer feedback that we have uh, got, it's very much analytic and insights. Uh, customer visit tracking has got increased. Resource allocation with the customer interaction has been increased. So these are the few uh, advanced things or I would say benefits that our customer has got after implementing uh, this tool. These are the uh, studies or uh, clients, few of them we have implemented for uh, uh, Udo and AI based document format as well. For example, North uh, NLC, Northern Academic in based out of USA, they are full fledged using this solution for the institute teaching management. Uh, likewise, for retail industry, Larson into diamond industry, they have to share the catalog of rings, ring builder, uh, how, how ring can be fitted, how necklace can be added. So this can be useful over there as well. In automobile and Balubed industry, we have given for user manual for repairing spare part uh, for their workers. Ajmal Perfume is our uh, PUS solution that we are using as well. So these are the few case studies and we have done. Thank you so much. <laughs> they would be happy to give you any kind of suggestion answers if you have any questions.
I have a question on the part here. Sure. So what is your pricing model? Do you have a special pricing for the education sector? So we are on a SaaS-based model, uh, subscription based on the user per license that we are working out. License model, obviously, we have uh, different, different for each and every uh, group of customer. Depends on the requirement, depends on the customization needed on this PDF tool, uh, how we can work out. So it's not, it's not having a specific pricing, but yeah, uh, we can upload that as well information shortly. Um, can you use the interactive PDF in sales module for quotes? Yeah, so that was the real case study that we did on the quote itself. Uh, we have given, uh, while not in a standard quotation format of sales order and product line items, it is more about AI driven, where lots of other informations, uh, related product, user manual, uh, videos, and uh, other useful information like, okay, how to use that product, how to uh, utilize and how to sell that product in a better way. So such kind of other information that PDF does contain in court. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, does the tool work with Odoo Enterprise only? Sorry? Does the tool work with uh, Odoo Enterprise only? Uh, no, there is no limitation. It can be, it's our standalone plugin, right? So you can utilize in community version as well, in enterprise also. The best benefit is like in enterprise, it's more useful because you are having other touch points, other modules and uh, fields and everything which you can leverage. So better benefit you will get in enterprise, but there is no limitation. That is standard, standalone tool that you can use in community and enterprise. And um, can we have 3D models of machines in an interactive view? Yeah, exactly. So I've, I missed out that point as well. We did a 3D uh, warehouse management on using this PDF where actually kind of digital twin where you capture your real warehouse into the system with the aisles, with the uh, rack and shelf that you are configuring into actual warehouse, you configure into system and system will give you insights like, okay, you don't need to physically go over there. From here only, you can navigate to that aisle, you can click on any bin, how many products are there, what are the SKUs, what are the barcode of that each and every product, you can identify from the uh, screen itself. You don't need to even go physically at your warehouse. So such kind of uh, usage we have done using uh, digital twin 3D warehousing. Yeah, it's a real time link. So if, 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 if any stock updates or stock movement happens at my delivery section, it's real time quantity get updated to my 3D view as well. So afterwards uh, you click on that, if 10 quantity got delivered, there will be 10 deduction in that uh, module as well. Yeah, real time. Perfect. Thank you so much. Have a good weekend. Yeah.